The US Army and Marine Corps are placing orders for a new sniper rifle, Barrett MRAD. Viewers may note that US Special Operations Command has already placed an order for the Barrett MRAD last year. US Special Operations Command purchased $50 million worth of MRAD rifles, which it designated the Mark 22 Advanced Sniper Rifle. The new rifle will slowly replace existing sniper rifles and heavier anti-material rifles in the inventory's U.S. ground forces. Barrett MRAD, or Multi-Role Adaptive Design Rifle, has a radically new design that will enable it to be used under different scenarios. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes Barrett MRAD sniper rifle of the U.S. military. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by the free-to-play military vehicle combat game War Thunder. We talk a lot about military vehicles on this channel, but what about trying them out for yourself? In War Thunder, you can choose from more than 1,200 playable vehicles from the 1930s to the 1990s and go to battle on more than 80 theaters of war. You can fly aircraft, helicopters, drive tanks, and command ships of all types and sizes, which have been carefully recreated from their real-world counterparts. It's available as a free download on PC, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One with cross-platform support. So grab your friends and give it a try. All viewers of Defense Updates that register using the link in the description below will also get a free premium tank, aircraft, or ship and three days of premium account time as a bonus. MRAD is a bolt-action rifle built into a heavy-duty metal chassis made of 7,000 series aluminum. It weighs around 14 pounds or 6.35 kilograms standalone. The weight will obviously increase if we include accessories like optic. The rifle is fed by a 10-round magazine. The shoulder stock folds to the side when not in use, shortening the length, which is useful when being carried in vehicle and during parachute operations. The most interesting aspect of MRAD is its ability to swap barrels, changing from one caliber to another. Generally, barrels of sniper rifles cannot be swapped on the go, neither can the caliber be changed from one caliber to another. MRAD enables barrel swaps and changes in caliber to operate in a variety of conditions, against different types of targets and at different ranges. The MRAD is chambered in the traditional sniper calibers of 308 Winchester and 300 Winchester Magnum. But it can also easily swap into 338 Lapua Magnum, 338 Norma Magnum, 6.5 Creedmoor, 300 Norma, and 300 PRC. This will provide excellent flexibility. For example, 308 Winchester is a super general purpose round suitable for urban environments, whereas 338 Lapua Magnum is much more powerful and better suited for the long-range kill. In addition to caliper changes, the rifle incorporates a fully adjustable stock. The stock can be adjusted in cheek rest height and length of pull. The weapon also has a full-length Picatinny rail to mount optics, image intensifiers, and other aiming tools. A large trigger is present, as well as an Atlas bipod which allows the shooter to achieve a stable aiming position while prone. The U.S. Army stated MRAD's range of 1,500 meters is 300 meters greater than that of the M2010 sniper rifle it will replace. It added, MRAD increases standoff distances, ensuring overmatch against enemy counter-sniper engagements and increases sniper capability. The Marine Corps, which has chosen the MRAD for its Advanced Sniper Rifle, or ASR, program, said the rifle will improve the sniper's ability to rapidly engage multiple moving targets. ASR will replace all current bolt-action sniper rifles in the Marine Corps, the service said in its budget request. It's a multi-caliber system featuring extended range, greater lethality, and a wider variety of special-purpose ammunition than current systems. According to reports, the U.S. Army and Marine Corps have placed orders for a combined 768 MRAD rifles worth $14 million. 
Both services have allocated funding in the proposed 2021 budget for the bolt action modular MRAD. The cost, approximately $16,000 per rifle, includes a sound suppressor and a variable power rifle scope. The weapon will replace the M2010 sniper rifles and M107 heavy sniper rifles. It's clear that the potential of the MRAD is recognized by different branches of the U.S. military and hence it's witnessing such widespread adaptation. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos like this. Hit the like button if you find the video interesting and kindly provide your feedback in the comment section. This will help us improve.